this is Luxury PL38. Today's unboxing is for the mini rectangle that was just being released and this particular color was quite anticipated because Chanel actually releases the iridescent ivory mid this year and it started with the mini rectangle and then it just trickles to the SLG afterwards. However, for the iridescent purple, Chanel actually releases the SLG first and as you can see I've got three of the SLG and from here you can see the differences even though they are all iridescent purple but they're just so different in the iridescent effect so I'm curious to see the mini rectangular what kind of iridescent purple it resembles whether it's towards the card holder or towards the mini okay so let's get into the actual unboxing I was so lucky to have gotten it through my essay because I did manage to contact her and I did request her to see if she can get this because it was just being released a couple of days ago and um, let me just see if I can find oh she actually gave this as well I'm not sure what this is so I'm gonna do the unboxing on that as well and this is the box let me just put that down that's the receive it is from the 20 b1 collections although it's just been released now but for some reason it is considered part of the 20 b1 collections so let's get into the actual unboxing as you can see the holiday packaging still have that glitter effect so I'm curious to see the iridescent purple effect of this mini rectangular and let's see which one it resembles closer to sorry I'm just trying to clear the way for the comparison oh wow let's see if I can just take this out instead of me trying to you can see the effect it's actually very close to the rainbow that was just being released early this year and just a little bit of tilting you can see the effect and as you can see the side it has that greenish kind of like greenish purplish so the iridescent effect of this is actually very very prominent and I don't think I can take that out from the side. I was hoping I can just slide the tissue paper but I think that it was being wrapped around Yep, the strap. So this is the iridescent purple mini rectangular that was just came out a couple of days ago and it still has that plastic sticker intact and this is the valve protector that it comes with and it actually looks so much better in real life because it has a very strong let me see if I can show that to you. It has a very strong, colorful, iridescent effect, and it is closer to this card holder. See how the iridescent effect changes quite a lot? It's more like a chameleon iridescent because even though it's considered purple, it has a strong shade of green you can see from here the camera actually captures the iridescent effect very well and it does resemble what it looks like in real life let me just show you the and this is the authenticity card it is the 309 series so even though this is part of the 20B collections the serial number is actually after the 21C the cruise collection that was just out last week so for some reason um, the serial number actually 
goes past the 21C collections, but they still classify this as a 20B collections. And I've just looked at the receipt, it is actually 20B1 collections. And this particular one is, let me see if I can see that. It is made in France, yep. So this is made in France. And if you look at the interior of the mini rectangular, see how it has a very metallic purple. The interior of it, um, it does not have a very strong iridescent effect. I think the leather on the interior is pretty much the same toned, which is pretty much that purple toned. If you look closely, it doesn't change. Um, which is pretty much the same as the top part of the flap, inner flap, and also this inside of the mini rectangular. So the iridescent effect is very prominent on the outside, on the bottom, on the side. See how it changes quite a lot? And also the back, the back pocket. To be honest, I am very, very um, surprised at this. I wasn't expecting the iridescent effect to be so prominent and it changes quite a lot. It is more like a chameleon bag. And it kind of reminds me of the rainbow iridescent that Chanel releases early this year. But instead of, a ver uh, because that one is in, um, I believe that was, that was in, goat skin or calf skin i believe it was in goat skin and that one has a glazing kind of like a glittery effect whereas this one it does not have that glittery effect but it showcased the iridescent very very well because this is actually in lamb skin and um, i just love the effect of it i'm just gonna keep on tilting the backs to show you how the iridescent effect just kept on changing and um, this particular one, even the strap has that. It's just amazing. And this is in the light gold hardware, champagne gold. I think it's actually a little bit yellowish compared to the champagne gold. So it's probably more like a gold hardware. But um, this is the new mini rectangular in the iridescent purple, which they just released. And um, once again, thank you so much for watching. If you do have any questions or comments, please do so in the sections below. And I absolutely love the iridescent effect of this. I'm just gonna post some pictures. And as you can see, it just keeps on changing.